One of the biggest surprises for me was when Kimber brought out a revolver and I was very pleasantly surprised. The, re the trigger on this, Rachel, it's awesome. Yeah, um, well, you know, listen, we made a lot of waves when we first released the revolver, specifically because our trigger was incredible and still is, but we wanted to bring out a double action, single action gun. Yeah. It was one of the first requests we got um, as soon as we released revolvers. Um, so here we have our new DASA. This one's in three inch uh, barrel, and then we have a two inch barrel as well. Well, and one of the other big things about it is this is a pretty compact package but it's a 357 Magnum with six shots. Yeah, absolutely. So um, we retain all of our um, standard K6S styling here. Our, our push button cylinder release um, releases the cylinder on a very, very trim, as you mentioned, uh, cylinder. These are all recessed, but this is um, engineered to be shot. We have a really well thought out ergo and this back strap here um, where you end up naturally being nice and high with the web of your hand. Um, we really want you guys uh, to go out and shoot these guns. They're a joy to shoot. Well, and having the single action option with the hammer gun, mm -hmm. it really kind of expands what's possible with this because you have a nice trigger, but you know, if you need to make longer shots, precision mm -hmm. shots, mm -hmm. taking that single action shot may be the best option. Absolutely, so our trigger weights are about nine to 11 on that double action. And then that single action that we've introduced on this gun is anywhere between three and a quarter and four and a quarter. And really crisp. Yes, absolutely. So you can see here when we cock this hammer, we're all the way to the rear of that trigger guard. Right. Incredibly, incredibly crisp trigger. Well, when you have a gun that shoots like this, a lot of people are gonna rediscover their love of revolvers. The Kimber K6S DASA. Well, the K6 is just a sweet revolver. People were really excited about it when it came out. But now you have the DASA, double action, single action. So you've got a hammer on this gun. Now the double action trigger pull is nice and you're just long double action pull but very smooth, no problem. But why would you want to have a hammer and why would you use that single action? Well first off, if you're going to have a hammer, don't mess around. The hammer is, is a, a good size, easy to, to cock it and has a little texture to it which is nice and it's going to cock the trigger for you as well, I mean it's cocking the hammer but it shortens that trigger pull for longer shots. But also, that shorter trigger pull when you do this, you have less travel distance on the pull. So with a longer trigger pull like a double action, there's more chance for you to pull the gun off target. And that's why people like shooting single action so much. Um, also, people who have trouble running a double action trigger, they may enjoy shooting this at the range. Now, for concealed carry, I would say probably practice that double action trigger pull. That's probably how you're gonna shoot it in a real life, life or death situation. But shooting at the range, longer distance shots, those kinds of things, you gotta love a sweet single action trigger.